Hey, what's up, Chaos TV family? What's up, Chaos TV network? And it's your Chaos leader himself, Chaos Hero, here, back out from the chaos to play part literally nine, ladies and gentlemen, nine of Pokemon Violet. Ooh, excuse me. And today, people, today, um, if you haven't seen part eight, aka, why are you running? Why are you running? We just got done smacking, literally, Clorf's cheeks. And, uh, I don't know where he is right now, but, um, uh, let's get to the recap before we, um, he was right here on his wall. Let me, uh, clap his cheeks real quick. I don't know where he is, and I don't know where he went to, but, oh, wait, wait, there he is. There he is. But before we start heading back down to the mountain... Let's give a quick recap of the team if you haven't seen this yet. But for those of you that follow, y'all can go ahead and skip ahead. My apologies. We have Charletta, our um, newly, most recently evolved uh, Florigato. We, uh, <clears throat> my bad, got the move set. Rocking Quick Attack, Home Claw, Magical Leaf, and Bite using the ability Overgrowth at level 16. Then we have <clears throat> Bardish, our Char Cadet, uh, which is level 16. Rocking Ember, Astonish, Clear Body, I mean Clear Smog, Fire Spin, and he is uh, uh, holding that fire, uh, Flash Fire ability real nicely, just in case, on GP. Um... <clears throat> Then we have Palmy, our uh, I mean uh, Picari, our Palmy at level 15, rocking Dig, Nuzzle, Thunder Shock, Quick Attack, and that Static ability. Then we have Wati, our Watchful, uh, at level 17, rocking Peck, Thunder Shock, Spark, Pluck, and Wind Power. Now I found out something fun: Wind Power. If you use Tailwind, it actually gives it that buff that you need for electric type moves. Which indirectly, I can slap a magnet on him. All right. Give it the nature it needs to have. Buff his speed and his special attack. This boy going to be broken. Going to be broken. Then last but not least, I mean, well, the second to last, my bad. Is Gaia our uh, Nick Nackley? I think that's how you pronounce it. Nackley uh, at level 15, rocking rock polish, rock throw, mud shot, smackdown, and that dope, dope ability purifying salt. I did not. So, purifying salt, what it does is it's basically, um, if any of you that are uh, for all my Chaos TV family f members. Uh, that's why I usually call the viewers, uh, that are either, um, pagan, Wiccan, or, or just very heavily religious on whatever religion you are. Um, basically what it does is the Pokemon pures, uh, salt protects it from statuses, conditions, and has the damage taken from ghost type moves. So basically it's basically like just like holy water salt kind of thing. Yeah, that whole thing. But moving on. We have Finrear, our Fido, um, at level 17, rocking Bites, Baby Doll Eyes, Covet, which is the most funniest move ever for a normal type move, Tail Whip, we need to get him some more fairy type moves like Play Rough, and uh, holding that good old ability on Tempo, which uh, if you are familiar with own Tempo, it prevents uh, being afflicted with Intimidate, basically. <laughs> so basically, he's on his own vibe. <clears throat> Uh, if y'all are wondering why I, I do, I do come down with a little bit of sniffles during the winter time, but yeah, that's about it. That's our squad for right now. Um, we don't really focus on natures right now because we're not getting into the panic side. We're just focusing on the story right now. So just recently I did try to do a picnic, but apparently I can't do picnics out here. So I need to know what areas to do picnics at. So I need to figure that out later. Pokemon Portal, I usually check Pokemon Portal mostly every day to check a lot of stuff for like online trading stuff, Union Circle, and stuff like that. 
also, fun fact, for those of you that, you know, uh, have been, like, a little worried about trying to get this game and, you know, is it good? Is it that buggy? Should I get it? Should I invest in it? It's all up to you, but honestly, growing it up in an era that I grew up in, when a game was buggy, our generation didn't have patches. It didn't have, oh, you could... You can get this, you can get this in a couple of weeks, just as long as you're connected to Wi-Fi and all that good crap. We didn't get start getting patches until like, I started getting into my like early like early to mid-teens. Um, if y'all can guess what year I was born in or what year uh, what era I was around in the gaming era, then good for you. But like I said, it, it's one of those things, um, it's one of those things that's not really a, it's a non-issue. They put so much into this game to where honestly it's 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 okay it, to me, in my opinion in my opinion where any y'all start harshing like the harshly attacking the comment section in my opinion it's not that bad it, it, it really isn't they put so much in this game you can forgive you know the sudden latent glitches here and there the fact that the sun sets any time you terrestrialize if you haven't seen my videos that thing right there that big bright ball in the sky for some reason literally turns to nighttime and as soon as your pokemon's knocked out it goes right back to daytime so i don't know if terrestrializing has to do with time but i know the the, the gimmick for this game is time because um pokemon sun apparently was all about you know ultra space which does bring up a fun fact question if literally wormhole spaces were popping up and palkia is the guardian of space why I mean, this thing attacks anything that's disturbing that balance. And if this had, it, it, it's just one of those third wall, or, or th like fourth wall breaking questions. Anyways, but uh, let's get to it. Hold on, let me see if I missed any items over here. Did I miss any items over here? No, I didn't. Um. Oh. Almost forgot to check something with the Pokedex. Uh, Fraggle Rocks. Um, hold on. So I found out, fun fact, just like cell phones, a lot of the um, Pokedex features on the cell phone have like objectives, like like little like minor objectives where you gain achievements and items and stuff. So if, okay, this one's two more volumes until your next reward. Okay, that's cool. So we kind of get like objectives and items like those like app gotcha games and stuff. And it, it does bring that kind of like cell phone incentive to the game, which is pretty cool, which kind of I like. Let me mark off these. So that way they ain't got to worry about them. Yeah, we caught all these. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so why? Are, okay, so the one. Okay, oh, I get it. So the ones that are dulled out are the ones we haven't caught. We just encountered them, which is cool. But when did I encounter this thing? That's the question. Um. Oricorio, I need to get the bylay Oricorio. Oh, cool. That seems pretty cool. Um, <clears throat> so, yeah. We're going to take care of all these right here. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I just want to go by the record by saying I do not want to crack uh, Quaxley. Uh, that thing looked weird. And what are these Pokemon? God's name is that thing. What is that thing? It looks like Godzilla. I know that's a Fomantis just from the silhouette alone. Um, but yeah, let's uh, let's 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 skip ahead, you guys. It's already been nine minutes in, and uh, I know y'all getting agitated. And, uh... Hey. Really was trying to sneak past you, but okay. Hey, bud, let me do me a solid. Let me run. Thank you. Bye.
I really want to get my boy done sparse. Now. Yo, there's a spoink out here in these walls right here, dude. There's a spoink out here in these walls, though. Hey, bro, there's a spoink. Oh, there's tons of spoinks. Okay, lit. Okay, we get we out here. I can build my whole pig team now. If they let Imbor over here. Man, my whole pig team is realized. My whole swine team. That poke, that swine, that pig. Alright, so first things first, I'm going to figure out how to get down from here. And you know what we do. Dukes of Hazard. Wow, the... F okay. Jump it down. Woo. I wonder if it moves or does it stay stationary or it just, just doesn't do anything. Oh, it just stays there. Because it's back to the wall. For some ungodly reason. Okay, we ooh. A oh, Growlithe. Are you shiny? Are you shiny? Heck no, you ain't shiny. Nope, I'm out of here. You're 17. Yeet! <clears throat> yeah, I ain't fucking with you. You things. Y'all nightmare fuel. Y'all claw y'all clorfs. Something clorfs? Cloths? I think they call y'all. Y'all are weird. Alright, let me get this uh, mission done over with for this Titan. Okay, bust open the wall. It busts open the walls. Uh, duh, where were you at? No Chlorf has gotten any business. No Chlorf's uh, has got any business being that big. So does it go back to its normal size? <sighs> Drinking some water. My bad. That, that cry will still never, never, ever unsettle me. Like, I mean, I'm sorry. That is nightmare fuel. Anyways. I'm going to hit that uh, home claw real quick. See where that takes us. boy shelter damn he is straight gunning for old boy shelter right now that is wild all right time for me to battle okay that does decent amount of damage ooh angry shell is that exclusive to him or is he just give the hidden ability
Ooh. That actually did a lot of damage. I'm a bite. Ooh. That actually, dang. sucking booty cheeks if I can't fucking kill this thing. Wow. Are you still harassing the mess out of that damn thing? Not defeat the Titan. But okay, we're gonna take that. We're gonna take it. You wanna learn headbutt. Okay, um, let's ask you. What do you want to do with Gaia? Gaia wants to forget rock polish and learn headbutt. Uh... Alright, guy, I'm trusting you on this one, girl. Because we're going to do an all, like, trust your Pokemon playthrough. Because I just found that out. So what are we getting out of here? Before it comes back. I thought we knocked it out. And if you were that worried, if it comes back, why don't you catch it? That's stupid. Watch your step, it's pretty dark. Obviously, it's not that dark if you doing all that. Sweet Herb Mystical. Okay. Mystical. For gut health. about y'all but don't y'all get a slight foster's home for imaginary friends kind of vibe with this song so this is Irvin's you know theme song I mean like it put in the comments section if y'all like get some kind of foster's home for imaginary friends kind of vibe if like if y'all for those kids that actually grew up with foster's home for imaginary friends this foster home for imaginary friends was lit it was always lit
Okay, can y'all, like, give me a picture where I'm not holding my face like that? That's kind of weird. And again, the frame rates always drop when this dude shows up. <laughs> hey, buddy. <laughs> Meridian, your sandwich. You learned a new ability, dash? What? You can dash now? I thought I was already dashing already. I oh, appreciate it, man. It's an ominous fade to black, though, but okay. Hold on, guys.
Sorry about that. <clears throat> ah, Toro. Hmm, for the left stick, okay. Professor, I'll keep it in mind. Mm -hmm. Hey, great or small, you got that right. Go forth on your journey and take good care of Meridian for me. You're welcome. It's just dropped though. Wait, was that just a ditto? Mm -mm. I'm gonna check back recording and see if that was a ditto. Fell off the cliff. Dang, frame rates do drop. So some of the ability is sturdy, like every standard rock type. Okay. I do not feel comfortable with that frame rate dropping like that. 
this is where we're gonna leave it off right here guys at this 30 minute or so mark um this has been your boy chaos hero and hopefully you enjoy this little bit of playthrough that we did we took on our first titan even though you know urban kind of did it for us in a way well, in a lot of ways but uh yeah i'm your boy chaos hero and uh we out take it easy